welcome back to another video and today we are doing my main uh, April pay and we're going to be cash stuffing them into these envelopes. We're going to be cash stuffing £815 this month uh, but before we go to the bank and get all the money out I want to organise my envelopes and make sure that they're ready to be cash stuffed when we get back. So then I'm gonna put some money uh, back into my account. So I want to basically sort it all out. So then when I come back, uh, we can get ready to go. So let's get started. So we'll see how much we had left over um, from each week basically. And it's actually quite interesting. I'm surprised I had so much left over. Uh, we'll start off with food shopping. Now in here we have 20, 30, 45. Now this is surprising to me but not at the same time i originally put uh, i think it was i have it all written at the back here 100 pounds in there so basically pretty much a week and a bit's worth i didn't spend on food shopping and basically that was because i couldn't be bothered to go and do the food shop i just used up what was in the cupboards um which i know that most people like won't be able to afford to do that uh but i had i i'm quite bad in the sense that i will still do a weekly shop even if I have food in the cupboards and in the fridge so I need to get out of that habit and kind of go completely empty in the cupboard wise before anyway so that's going to put straight back into my um I'm undecided whether to put it straight back into account or put it in my the big spend um what should I do I might put I might put it all into the big spend actually yeah, I'm going to pull it, put it all into the big spend. <laughs> Go for it. Right, okay, so that's in the big spend. Um, so we have now nothing in the food shop, which is good. Train tickets, we've still got the same amount that was in there. That's 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 60. Um, nothing more is going in there. Well, it, it will be, but not right now. We're not removing anything. Nothing in petrol. Gifts, nothing. Not going to change that. Time of friends. I'm going to let that build up in there. Um, hobbies, let that build up. Side hustles, let that build up. Beauty, let that build up. Um, clothes, nothing in there. Holiday, let that build up. Exercise. I might take some money out of there. So how much have I got left? I've got uh, 10, 20. I might take a 10 out um, and leave a 10 in there and put a 10 in the big spend. Room decor, I'll let that build up. There we are. So now basically we have, um, right now in the big spend, we have 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 105 pounds in the big spend. Um, and then to go back into my account, um, Eight fifty sometimes. <laughs> um, to go back into my account, we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 30, 5, 40. So 145 pounds to go back into the bank. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this back um, and put that into my bank account whilst taking the money out, which I haven't actually taken out yet. So I can do that at the same time. Um, I was debating whether to kind of use some of this money up instead of taking it out, but mentally in my head, I like to put it away and get new money out, um, which is, I don't know, probably not the best way of doing it. But yeah, so I'm going to go to the bank now and get my money out and give this money back. Okay, so we are back from the bank. Um, I've laid out all my notes here just to make it easier. And this is, I don't know why I'm explaining that. Anyway, let's get straight into it. So this is slightly different to last month. We're definitely stuffing less. Last month we... Uh, stuffed £1,010 so I'm trying to stuff less because I want there to be more in my savings in my bank account um, plus I was left over with quite a lot of money so I didn't need to do as much as I did but I'd rather always have more than less um, so let's go straight into it so food shopping last month was uh, £100 but we're reducing it to £80 per month so that equates to £20 per week because I have a habit of not finishing all the food um, and yeah, like I, I could make stuff bigger and then have it for the next dinners, if that makes sense. Um, so what we're just going to do with that, we're literally just going to get four 20s um, in there. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80 going into food shopping. I don't know. Maybe this isn't the right amount. I'm not sure. I need to play around with this for a couple of months before knowing if this is going to really work. Um, just make sure you can see the 50s there I think you can um yeah anyway so that's food shopping done um next train tickets now I did stuff 160 pounds 
last month, but I'm only doing 80 uh, this time. Um, and I am doing that again in 20s. So the same, four 20s. So 20, 40, 60, 80. I'm gonna go into the office next month. Um, so I will be starting to spend this money. So I'm really happy that I put a lot in there last month um, as it just gave me the kickstart that I needed. Um, so now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, and 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, and 20, 40. So 240 pounds in there. I think it's costing me about 15 pounds a day to get the train, uh, but I don't think we're gonna be go, like, go back full time anytime soon. Uh, so it's going to be reduced numbers and stuff like that. So anyway, that should do me fine for a long time. Um, petrol, I did write down 40 initially, but last minute I was like, no, I'm going to do 50. So I'm literally just doing 50 again. The 50 is more than enough for my petrol. But again, like I said in my other videos, I am driving more places, seeing more people, putting the effort in um, to see more people. I think 50 pounds used about half a tank no about I think I've used about half a tank so I don't know if I'll be even able to fill it up using the 50 but we're still playing around with the numbers um gifts so I'm going to put in 40 pounds per month 10 pounds per week and I'm literally just doing that in tens um so yeah I've got 10 20 30 40 now last month what did I put in there um I did 20 and then ended up doing another 20 I think um because i'd spent all the gift money i think so i need to have i need to look back at my one yeah i've got 20 in here already um so we have 20 30 40 50 60 now uh in there which is a nice amount to have i'm gonna let that build up um because people's birthdays will come soon and all that stuff anyway so car maintenance um i'm doing 60 pounds this time uh i'm gonna do that with 20s again no, I'm not. I'm doing that with a 50 and a 10. So now we have 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 110, 130, 140. Wow, that took a lot of brain power from me there. Um, so there we are, 140 in there, which is a nice number to have. Let it build up. Um, yeah, I thought instead of using 10 million 20s, I could just use a 50. Although I hate the 50s. In a car place, you just give them the cash. You don't have to whittle it down or anything, so it's fine. Um, time with friends. So last month, I think I did 120. I'm doing 100 this time uh, because I am left over with some money. I'm left over with, oh, jumble out there, 20, 40, 60. So I'm left with 60. So I only use 60 pounds. Um, so I'm going to do the time with friends. Uh, how am I doing that? I've got it all written down over there, but I can't really see it. Two 20 pound notes. Four tens, two, three, four, and four fives. Now I think that works. Because I've literally done 25 pounds four times, if that makes sense. So we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 5, 90, 5, 100. Yep, that works. And now with the amount as well, we've got... 20, 40, 60, 80, 110, 10, 20, 30, 40, 5, 50, 5, 60. So we have 160 pounds in time of friends now. I'm gonna let that build up, but I'm, I might change it because as much as I love my friends, I genuinely don't know if I'd spend that amount in a month, but then it's always nice to have more in case you fancy being extra social. Um, hobbies, I'm just putting 20 in there. Uh, same as always, but I've done two turns this time. Um, what, how, how much have we got left over in here? We have, okay, a five left. So, oh, I'm really struggling with putting the money down today. We have 10, 20, five in there now, which is quite nice. A um, Little bit extra. Don't know what I could spend that on this month, to be honest with you. Uh, hobbies, side hobbies. So I've still got uh, both the 20s in there. 120 was from the last pay and 120 was from my uh, other YouTube channel's pay um, because I think you should put money back in. Not that I have anything really to spend my money on on these YouTube channels at the moment. But anyway, it doesn't matter. We're putting another 20 in there. So now we have 20, 40, 60 pounds overall. 
Um, I'm not putting as much into the YouTube videos as I was initially, uh, into my YouTube channel. I think once you get started, you should be good, but it's always good to have money like that. Um, beauty, now we do have quite a lot of money left over actually, um, but I'm still doing, um, I'm doing a hundred pounds, which I think was the same as last time. 120 last time. So you see I'm kind of shaving it away in little areas um, like that, like 20s here and there, just to kind of get it lower. Uh, beauty, we are doing it in 20s. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 100. Uh, and we have left over 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 95. So here we are, and we'll put that all together, all together now. <laughs> Um, okay, that's all backwards. Right, I know that some people actually notice that, which I have never noticed. Now I can't unsee it when I watch people's videos. Um, so I'm gonna make sure I do it all right. Um, like that. Okay, so now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 60, 70, 80, 95. So 195. I knew that already, but you know, it's fun counting all your money, isn't it? <laughs> um, so I'm doing things like getting my hair done. Now I know that my hair will most definitely cost more than this. Um, so it probably will come out of my bank account um, as a big sum. And then I'll probably maybe put half in the ca from cash. It's, it's difficult because I haven't been doing this for long enough to really be able to spend all that money on my hair yet. But I get my hair done literally once a year, literally once a year. Um, so... I feel like it's okay to get it out of the bank account. I'm not justifying it, <laughs> I'm just saying. Um, also, my nails have grown so quickly um, these last couple of weeks. I don't remember my nails growing this quickly before lockdown. I don't know, maybe if I'm eating something different. Anyway, that's beauty, so I can get my nails done. That's fine. Um, clothes, £60 per month. That was 80 last time. And I definitely spent all the 80 but I feel like I have try to buy stuff that's more expensive, better quality or secondhand better quality. So it's not as expensive, if that makes sense. Uh, so we are doing clothes. We are doing, uh, what have I done there? Uh, I think it's in, I think it's in twenties. Yeah, in twenties. Two, four, six. Yeah. So we have 20, 40, 60. There we are. Um, going into clothes. So yeah, things like buying off Depop, I've tried to do like expensive brands such as like Karen Millen, I brought off Depop, so that meant you got the quality, but it wasn't as expensive. Um, holidays, so I'm putting £160 away, which I think is the same as last time, and I have literally done it 50, 100, 150, and a 10, um, like that. So um, that is exactly how I'm doing that. So I do have money left over, obviously, because I haven't gone holiday. 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 40, 60. So we'll put that here. We've got 50, 100, 150, 160, 170, 180, 190, 110. Yep. 110, <laughs> 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 and 110, 120. Wow, that really took a lot of brain power. That 220, in fact, not 120. Um, I don't know what's up with my brain today. I haven't eaten lunch yet. Maybe that's why. <laughs> um, right, put that all in there. I might have to change some of the 20s up to 50s soon in general. Um, ones like car maintenance and stuff. Uh, yeah, put it all to 50. So exercise, we are left with 10. Um, so in here we have 45. So this works out perfectly as the end of this load of cash stuffing. So we have 10 left over and I'm putting in 45 pounds. This changed last minute from 40 to 45 because my PT sessions, now I'm showing with a friend, come to 15 pounds a session. So I've literally put 15 in three times, literally like this. So 10, 5, 10, 5, 10, 5, like that. So we have 45 going in with a 10 left over, which is always quite nice to have, uh, just in case, I don't know, just in case I fancy being extra active <laughs> or I want to do an extra gym class or I don't do a PT session and I want to do a yoga class, etc. 
So yeah, in there we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 5, 55. Perfect. And I haven't done room decor. In all honesty, I completely forgot about it. Uh, but actually, I'm quite happy with it being something that my other YouTube channel goes towards or just something that stays there if I ever fancy changing up my room. Um, so far, nothing has come out of here. I think probably a 10 could come out for something. I feel like there is something, but I'm going to leave it in there. Uh, 10, 25 for that there. Um, and then we have the big spend, which now has, as we worked out, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 105 pounds. So there we are. That is where we're at this month. Um, I am, I have got in my notebook a little tracker and nothing in the back to accounts, but I will keep track of that um, each time. I have on my, my little notebook, I've <laughs> done a little tracker, which I know looks probably really quite shocking um but just a way of me keeping track of what's in where um i just realized i missed out uh room decor again on here <laughs> um so what i'm doing is things like april pay i had 45 left in there and there was still 45 left in there and now i've added 100 so i'm going to be like 45 plus 100 now there's 145 in there things like that um on here so what I don't feel like I'm so blind as to what's in there as I'm going along, but it's mainly just for my sanity, really. I like having stuff written down instead of having to count it out each time. Um, but yeah, I hope this video helped you uh, or inspired you. If not, this is, I'm happy for this just to be, for me to be held accountable um, to doing this. So far, I'm actually really enjoying uh, what I'm doing. It, it's meaning that I am purposely trying to spend more time with friends trying to spend more money on hobbies trying to you know spend better ways of money really it is hard using cash in the uk i'm not gonna lie it is a bit frustrating but again if you're from the uk and not so many places taking cash just have one of these spend it out of your bank account and put it back in here and if you can't take it out of your bank account because you've taken it all out here wait a month put some money into savings and then do it um because yeah, I understand that not many places um, take cash nowadays. But anyway, uh, I have a little thing for today that uh, if you could recommend me another envelope, what would it be? Um, I would love to know. I really wanna start building these up and whittling money away elsewhere and stuff like that. Uh, even if it's fives or something every, every month, just to something, I don't know. I've, it'd be quite nice to know what you'd recommend as another envelope for me to have. Um, so yeah, that'd be really interesting and we'll start some nice conversations in the comments below. But please do like and subscribe and thank you so much for liking and subscribing anyway. This is, yeah, pretty crazy that I've kind of already created a little community, which is so nice, um, of such lovely people. So yeah, I will see you um, on my next video, which will be my YouTube pay um, for May. Um, so thank you so much for watching, guys, and thank you for your support and I'll see you very soon. Bye!